The Commuter is the newest action thriller from the director of The Shallows and Nonstop. Liam Neeson stars as an ex-cop turned insurance salesman who's pulled into a complicated conspiracy on board a New York City commuter train. Neeson's joined by Vera Farmiga, Patrick Wilson, and Sam Neill. Now The Commuter is very similar to Neeson's other popular action movies like Taken, in some ways way too similar. Like a lot of Neeson's other movies, his character at first comes across as a typical father caught up in the daily grind of life, but when pressed, he suddenly develops a very particular set of skills. Skills I've acquired over a very long career. Then, as per usual, Neeson punches and shoots his way through a slew of bad guys in hopes to save the day. You know, you're pretty much getting exactly what you might expect from this movie. A mediocre plot driven forward by sporadic action sequences. But the action in this movie is polarized on the opposite ends of the action spectrum. It's either lame or it's way too outrageous. There's really nothing in between. Neeson is pretty good, but definitely not at his best in a movie that would be completely unwatchable if anyone else starred in the leading role. And that's why I give The Commuter a three. Yeah.